Hello to all my fellow Numismatic Coin collectors out there. This is Numismatic King with another Numismatic Coin update. Today I'm going to be doing a coin review on the Perth Mint Australia Opal Series 1 ounce proof coin set. First coin I'm going to be talking to you guys about is the Australian Opal Series Koala. This coin comes with a certificate of authenticity. And this coin number is number 4,674 of a total of 8,000 coins minted. I actually started out my YouTube channel reviewing this particular coin. And I wasn't really expecting anything. However, I soon found out that there is a very large interest in the YouTube community about numismatic coin collecting and numismatic coins. So, this coin comes in a very nice presentation packaging by the Perth Mint Australia. When you open it up, the light automatically turns on. And this is the Koala. The design is pretty hard to see without the light. Again, this light is to signify nocturnal animals that come out uh, at night in Australia. And this coin is featuring the koala. The reverse of the coin is depicting the queen. And it has very, very nice detail. I really like this coin set. The attention to detail is just phenomenal. And next coin in the series is the Australian Opal Series Wombat. And this coin also comes with a certificate of authenticity. This coin is 5,946 of a total 8,000 coins minted. And this coin comes in a similar presentation packaging with a light that turns on when you open the case. And this is the Opal Series Wombat. It's kind of tough to see without the light. But this coin is just beautiful. And the reverse of it is the same as the koala, depicting the queen. Very, very nice detail. And the most recent release in the series is the Opal Series Kangaroo. I just added this to my collection recently. Comes with a certificate of authenticity. And this coin is 776 out of a total of 8,000 coins minted. Presentation packaging. And this is the Opal series kangaroo the backgrounds of all these coins are are different however the reverse side is the same very very finely detailed coin in proof finish which makes this a very numismatic coin Eight thousand mintage is, is very limited for the Perth Mint Australia. And these coins are very unique, which is why I love this series. So today I'm gonna to be talking about the silver price. 
Silver is, is still down. Uh, excellent buying opportunity for whoever is looking to get into the silver game or to add to their stack. I uh, picked up some one ounce uh, one ounce pandas, 2013 Chinese pandas today. And it's because of the very low spot price that I went in on the order. I picked up some some sheets of Chinese pandas, which I know I will do pretty well on in the years to come, considering the 2012 Chinese pandas are selling for $45 on websites like Appmex and Provident Metals is selling them for a nice premium. The 2011 is selling for $55. 2010 is selling for 60. And it's just a trend, guys. Longer you hold on to the one ounce Chinese pandas, the higher the premiums go, regardless of silver spot price because of their numismatic, well, their semi-numismatic uh, potential. People just love these Chinese pandas. They're willing to pay a lot for them. So at the current spot price, I just couldn't resist to order some 2013 one ounce Chinese pandas. And I would also like to give a shout out to Silverfish VT. He's uh, also very big on the silver YouTube community. He uh, makes very inspirational videos, guys. I just love uh, watching his videos and hearing what he what he has to say about silver and why he's collecting silver. He does it not for himself. That's that's what's great about it. He does it for his family, for his future, which is a very good message for a lot of collectors to hear his his side of the story why he started collecting and why he continues collecting and how he's getting his kids into collecting for the next generation of coin collectors, which is pretty awesome, guys. I have a lot of respect for Silverfish VT. His videos are very inspirational. And he talks about a lot of semi-numismatic, the 2013 kooks, He's advocating the kookaburra, and he also advocates uh, semi-numismatic coins, which is great, because he explains how the premiums keep, keep going up every year, if you know which semi-numismatic coins to invest in. So, this is going to be a relatively short video. Um, also, I would like to mention uh, Rocky315W uh, he's he's uploaded some new videos I've seen recently something about magnets something about Craigslist I don't know what he's talking about he's not talking about silver that's for sure um, a lot of his subscribers just watch his videos because of the you know, he's he's pretty funny. He's a, he's a funny guy. They like watching his videos because he rants on about just random stuff. You know, he mentioned silver. But the majority of, of his talks are... Are just rants about random things. I mean, I, I have respect for the guy. He's the, the grandfather of silver on YouTube. He's one of the first guys that started... Silver channel on on YouTube, which is great. But recently, he's been calling me out a lot, saying uh, how he wants to do a Skype session with me, and he wants to record it. Um, I'm up for that. You know, I have no problem with that. I told him, okay, that's fine. Let's do it. And then now he's trying to send reply videos. Reply videos are blocked on my account because I don't want spam. 
However, I'm in, I'm enticed to unblock reply videos and see what kind of videos he's trying to send me. So he he mentioned me on one of his videos. He didn't give my my YouTube channel. He's trying to defame my channel, guys. He thinks he can uh, limit my viewers because I don't know he feels threatened or or what. I I really don't understand it. But I, I'm just, you know, observing, I'm just saying it how it is. I'm, I'm observing what he's talking about. I'm observing the things he says on his videos. And how many people follow what he says. And I'm a numismatic guy myself. I invest in bullion, however, I invest in semi-numismatic bullion. Because whoever has invested in bullion in the past has seen a, a large decline in their investment recently. The more the silver spot price goes down, the more their uh, bullion silver investments are going down with the market. So YouTube is a great community because we can all share our opinions. So I don't know why he's getting all worked up. This is simply my opinion. I invest in numismatics because they yield very, very good premiums, regardless of silver spot price. Again, if you know which numismatics to invest in and what price to pay for these numismatic coins. So let me know your thoughts, guys. Um, I'm not sure what's going to be next in these in this series after the kangaroo. I'm... Uh, Guessing it's going to be another, just another animal. They're not really nocturnal. They're just going to be another Australian animal. However, the coins are very, very nice. So whatever animal they, they do decide to release next, very interested to, to know your thoughts. And I'm most likely going to complete this set because I have not been disappointed so far with the coins that I've purchased in this set. And these are the three again. The Koala, Wombat, and the Kangaroo. So if you like this video, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'd like to know your thoughts, guys. Comment in the section below, and let me know which coin you think the Perth Mint Australia is going to release next in the Australian Opal series. Again, this was Numismatic King with another Numismatic Coin update. Signing out.